14 Amazing Science Facts Did you know that bananas are radioactive? Bananas contain potassium and since potassium decays, that makes the yellow fruit slightly radioactive. But don't worry, you would need to eat 10 million bananas in one sitting to die of banana-induced radiation poisoning. A laser can get trapped in water. A cool thing called total internal reflection happens when you point a laser beam at a jet of flowing water as seen here. Total internal reflection occurs when a beam of light slowed down by the heavier particles in water hits some medium boundary or the edge of the water spout at a particular angle, so it reflects rather than passes straight through. This happens over and over again as the light hits each boundary, so the laser remains caught in waterfall even as the water flow is gradually decreased. Helium can work against gravity. Helium, the second most abundant element in the universe when cooled to extreme temperatures just a few degrees away from absolute zero, turns into a superfluid, meaning it can flow without friction. It can climb up and over the sides of a glass and it can even leak through molecule thin cracks in a container. It can rain diamonds on some planets. The atmosphere in Neptune, Uranus and Saturn have such extreme pressure Men are more likely to be colorblind than women. The genes responsible for the most common type of colorblindness are found on the X chromosome, the National Eye Institute explains. Even if women have the genes on one of their two X chromosomes, a properly functioning gene on the other one makes up for that loss. If men inherit the gene on their only X chromosome, they'll become colorblind. Bats don't get sick from most viruses. With more than 1400 species, bats are the second most diverse group of mammals on earth. They live on every continent except Antarctica and range in size from 2 to more than 1000 grams. They fly, they echolocate and some live up to 41 years, a long time for animals of their size. They are also known to carry many different kinds of viruses including coronaviruses, with no ill effects. Bats can of course contract and spread viruses, but according to research funded by the European Commission, they also have plenty of genes responsible for antiviral activity, keeping them out of harm's way. One exception to this is rabies, and although bats do occasionally get sick from rabies, it rarely kills them. Earth's oxygen is produced by the ocean. Have you ever stopped to think where oxygen comes from? Your first thought may be trees or rainforest, which is true as they are responsible for producing almost half of the world's oxygen. But here's a cool science fact for you. We can thank plant-based marine organisms for all the rest of the fresh air, according to National Oceanic Service. Planktons, seaweeds, bacteria, and other photosynthesizers produce more than half of the world's oxygen. Tungsten is the hardest metal in the world. More than 75% of the 118 elements on the periodic table are made of metals. They are diverse and vary in structure and properties. For example, aluminum is lightweight and malleable while mercury is liquid in form. However, tungsten is the hardest metal known to humans. That is why it is used for heavy-duty industries such as space travel and ballistics.
Hot water freezes more quickly than cold water. The principle of hot liquids freezing faster than cold ones is called the Mapemba effect. This phenomenon was discovered by a Tanzanian student when he realized that a hot ice cream mix freezes faster than cold mix in the early 1960s. Although it has been attempted, no one has successfully explained why hot water would freeze faster than cold water. Solar flares are incredibly powerful. The energy solar flares release is equivalent to millions of 100 megaton atomic bombs exploding at once, according to NASA. So it's a good thing that the Earth's atmosphere protects us from their radiation. Scientists weigh planets through their gravitational pull. You may wonder how we have all these measurements for planets when it seems impossible to measure objects in space, much less objects as massive as the planets. To weigh a planet, scientists need to know two things. How long it takes objects to orbit the planet and how far away those objects are from the planet. The time it takes an object to orbit a planet depends on its distance from the planet and the planet's weight. So provided they know the time and the distance of the objects, they can calculate the mass of the planet. The biggest tsunami reached over 1,000 feet. The largest tsunami ever recorded occurred in Lituya Bay, Alaska in 1958. The huge wave reached a staggering height of 1,720 feet and was caused by an earthquake. The subsequent study of this event led to the establishment of the term mega tsunami to distinguish it from ordinary tsunamis. It is also possible that much larger mega tsunamis occurred in prehistory. Researchers analyzing the geological structures left behind by prehistoric asteroid impacts have suggested that these events could have resulted in mega tsunamis that exceeded 4,900 feet in height. Humans are capable of producing venom. A new study has revealed that humans along with all other mammals and reptiles have the capability of producing venom. The study has shown that the genes that regulate our salivary glands are the same that allow snakes to produce oral toxins. Human saliva also contains a key protein called calicrein, which is present in a number of venomous secretions. Therefore, while we do not currently possess a death-inducing bite, we already have the basic components for the development of a deadly bite, and the prospect of one day evolving such a weapon is not out of the question. About half of your body is bacteria. Human cells make up only 43% of the body's total cell count. The rest are bacteria, viruses, and fungi. The greatest amount of these microbes are in our bowels. Experts estimate that the human body consists of 39 trillion bacteria and 30 trillion human cells, a roughly 1 to 1.3 ratio. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe. See you on the next one.